back to our channel இந்த வீடியோக்குள்ள போ முன்னாடி நீங்க ஒன்னு நம்ம சேனல்ல சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணல மறக்காம சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணிக்கோங்க வாங்க வீடியோக்குள்ள போலாம் back to our channel and this video we are going to solve the today's daily challenge and today's date is january 26 so i would like to wish you all a happy republic day so let's get united and stay together and let's celebrate together so one thing i would like to say here so consistency is the key to success so whatever you do just do it more consistently and you will definitely reach your goal okay so now let's get started so the question is sub matrices diagonal elements sum so what they have given is we must accept a integer matrix m of size r cross c and an integer n as the input okay and we must print the sum of the diagonal elements of all the n into n non overlapping sub matrices in m as the output so we are getting a matrix of size r cross c and an integer n and we must print the sum of the diagonal elements of the n cross n overlapping sub matrices so for that you must get a matrix and you must uh, divide it into some sub, sub matrix and from that you must add up or the sum the diagonal values and print it as the output okay so this is the input format they have given here so the first line contains the r and c which is separated by the space and the next r line each contains c integer values which is also separated by a space okay so this is the sample input output so you can see that the sum of the first sub matrix is of the diagonal elements are been printed and the second one also get printed okay and today i'm going to solve this one using the python language okay so initially i am going to create a function name calculate diagonal okay calculate calculate diagonal sums so we must calculate the diagonal sums to dimension like that so the values x is the r c and the n okay and now the diagonal the diagonal sums will be just keeping like this and now for i in range of which is which will be ranging from 0 and r and the split value will be the n okay and here for j in range it ranges from 0 c and n and now we must ensure the sub matrix fit within the boundaries or not so for that if i plus n is less than or equal to r and j plus n is less than or equal to c then the diagonal then the diagonal sum will be equal to 0 okay and now here for k in range of n the diagonal the diagonal sum gets incremented to the matrix of i plus k we just mentioned it. k here cross j plus k this is the primary diagonal just we are keeping like that and the secondary diagonal so our diagonal sum gets incremented to the matrix of i plus k cross j plus n minus k minus 1 so this is the secondary diagonal just keep mentioned like that okay and we must now avoid the double counting the center element in odd size sub matrix so for that uh, just coming out of which one they can go here yeah we can come here so if n percent uh, modulo 2 is equal to 1 then the diagonal then the diagonal sum gets decremented to the matrix of i plus n uh by 2 cross j plus n by 2 okay and now the diagonal sum will get appended to the diagonal diagonal sum here okay and now coming out of this we must return the diagonal sums okay
and now we are getting the input from the user the values map of int comma input dot split here and now the matrix matrix will be equal to getting a list list of map of int comma input dot split for underscore in range of the r okay and the n value n is equal to int input and for the result we must uh, call our main function name that is calculate diagonal sums if the values is matrix r comma c comma n and finally we are printing the result okay so now let us run our code and check for the output okay i'm getting a error here diagonal sum dot diagonal sum okay so this is the diagonal sums okay so that the integer object which mentioned like that so let me try once again and i'm getting another error here so i'm getting a little bounding okay so for that the values exist just i'm mentioning is the asterisk here so now let me print the again so yeah you can see that my code has been successfully passed without getting any error and if this video finds useful please do like share subscribe for more videos and once again a happy republic day thank you for watching do support share our channel thank you